<laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. I had an idea while hanging out. This is my son's great grandpa Gilray here. He's a true American hero and he served in World War II. Years ago, I adopted some of his tools, specifically an old vintage toolbox of his. Great grandpa Gil was a part of the supply corps while serving in the military. I had a great conversation with him years ago. He arrived in Normandy D-Day plus two. So with this little garage project today, I wanted to get my son involved and I wanted to create something that would honor him and his legacy. I wanted to use these little inexpensive cedar posts, about 250 a piece. I also wanted a little ghost wood right here. This stuff has some really nice textures, but it is a little pricey, but I'm gonna only use a little bit of that. Let me introduce you to my son, Vinny, right here. Vinny got to meet Grandpa Gil when he was a little baby. I thought this little project would get Vinny involved and learn how to use his hands a little bit in the wood shop. That's actually the vintage toolbox of Grand great Grandpa Gil's that we're recreating right there. So I'm having him make a little template around there. This was Vinny's first time using the table saw. He did a great job. I sure would love to earn a like and a subscription from you. If you could do that down below and maybe even add a comment somewhere, I'd much appreciate that. I'm trying to grow this little channel as much as possible to show my son that uh, we can do it. Um, yeah, that'd be awesome. Good, that's plenty. Oof, that was a lot. Okay. Sorry, let's smooth it out a little bit. Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay, so we got that there. I decided to use little cabinet screws for this. We pre-drilled -drill everything. And as you can see, we glued two. Um, but uh, these little cabinet screws are amazing. I used them on a last uh, a project a few weeks ago, and uh, they just they just make it look so clean. And they have that brass finish to them that I like. Let me know if any of you dads out there are struggling to keep your kids off the video games. This is my solution: getting them in the garage. These are actually late Grandpa Gill's tools right here that we're putting into there. That's actually my dad's hammer. And uh, yeah, now we have a place to store our old vintage tools 
And Vinny has a really cool toolbox that uh, he can keep as a memento for himself of his great grandpa Gil. Thanks for watching.